we are finally headed out on this gorgeous Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Gas stop first, and the sky looks dope. Still in the city because there's a million accidents. Oh my gosh, I said that wrong. There's a million accidents on the main highway that goes down, so we're cruising through town. Okay, so I totally needed food because I didn't eat this morning at all. I put my seatbelt on because safety first. I was trying to find out which restaurant was closest off the highway so we could get off and get back on. We stopped at this Arby's here, walked all the way up to the door, <laughs> and realized that they don't even open until 10 o'clock because it's still 8 something. Eat fresh! This is like the biggest subway bag ever. morning. It is 9-11. We are on our way up. I, mean, I know most people do, but... I think that's where we're headed. I don't know yet though. So I totally set my GoPro right here to shoot a time lapse but I didn't turn it on. So imagine all this stuff going really, really fast. It's got a black head on it. This is the top. Made it to the top. <laughs> no, no, to the left. Keep going. Oh, right out there. Yeah. I was just saying, I hope this GoPro doesn't fall off this clip here, but look at that shot. Ooh, this is a dope spot. That's my sister right there. This is insane. I was out on this rock over here, and all the way over here I had my camera, and I attached it to my weighted bag so it wouldn't fly off this uh, clip over here. But that one might go, so I gotta grab that. Time to head back down. I think this is 5.5 miles, so... I don't know what the so is for. That doesn't mean anything. It's like 5.5 miles. Yo, look where we're at. Woo! We're gonna go 
check out this cave, but first, check out this cliff I'm standing on. What are we about to check out? Bear cave. Okay, it's getting crazy windy out here, so I don't know how much you can hear. I'm talking behind a tree. We're gonna go check out this cave that's along this cliff here. I should bust out the GoPro head strap, actually. Oh, shit, <laughs> we found him. This is a cool cave. It's like really crumbly, like constantly falling apart. Yeah, is it just the rock kind type? I think it's... Whatever kind of rock this is, is super duper soft and it just keeps breaking it away constantly. Everything does. So this is like the bedroom up here. That's just storage. This is like the living space slash dining slash everything. Easy climb up? No. <laughs> like I said, it could be done, but it scares me because it would crumble. I'm gonna need an expert. The stash box, because it's locked. Oh, it's a key, it's uh, a key cache. So we go put two. I bet you we could put the app in and find the code for it. There's only like 10,000 combos. I can't believe we found a box, though. There's a, it's a ghost, it's, it's a Halloween thing. It's a Halloween thing. There's oh, a ghost. Oh, it's a scavenger like, hunt. Oh. <laughs> Secret hideout, here we go, scrappy dude. Oh, damn, we're going to the party. Where is this party at? Everybody hit up this address. Look at these trees. They have these wraps on them. We'll get a closer look. Oh, it's carved. Never mind, I thought there was a strap around it. What is that for? I don't know. Yeah, the chunk's on the floor there. But why do you do that? That's a question. Oh. Steps, nature steps, nature challenge. <laughs> Look at those two peaks out there too. The far distance. Oh, that might be like heaven. So I want to mount my GoPro up here to watch us walking down, which will look cool. So I'm gonna drag this stuff with me. I've got my GoPro strapped here. We're gonna first go down. We're gonna go down to this one! And then we're gonna go down to this one. <laughs> that looks cool. There's my GoPro. This rock looks like that house on the highway that I always shoot. Jump off the rock. We're coming. Gotta strap the gear. Look at this thing. <laughs> Here's the shit. Jeez.
like every Disney movie. That's it. get some food and drink somewhere. to head home. We're gonna try to avoid rush hour traffic because it's, it's like four o'clock now and yeah. got home. Oh my gosh, I'm exhausted, but that was a good day. I had to verify. The crazy thing is, it's only 5.45, so <laughs> I have to at least stay up for like five to six hours. Otherwise, I'll wake up in the middle of the night. I actually went to bed pretty early last night in preparation for today, and 3.37-ish. I remember it because I looked over the clock and I was like, what time is it? I think if we just kind of put everything away and relax a little bit, I might even have some coffee because I want to go to bed now.